This is going to be our final week before the summer holiday of our PE with MK Sports. Uh, this is the Key Stage 1 video. So, all we're going to do is we're going to do a bit of a fun with some with a pair of socks and a target, a bucket I've got here. And it's going to be a fun little game. Before we go into some static stretches, we're really going to try and I'll try and teach you about a bit more about stretching um, and some stretches you can do and how long to do them for. But the first game is really simple, I'm going to show you now. So, you're going to be about roughly about a metre or two metres, depending how confident you are at throwing, away from your bucket. Before you throw your pair of socks, that's what I've got here, my trusted pair of stinky socks, I'm going to do five squats before I have to throw the socks. So I'm going to go one, two, three, four, five. And then I'm going to try and throw the ball, uh, ball, tennis, pair of socks into the bucket. If I've thrown it in and I get it in, I can take one big step back from there. So now it's going to get harder, but before every time I've got to do five squats. One, two, three, four, five. I'm going to throw again. If I miss, I've got to go pick it up. Before I can throw again, I'm going to be at the same place. Before I throw again, I've got to do five more squats. One, two, three, four, five. And I'm going to try and go again. And I got it in this time. I'm only going to get it in one more time to do it correct. But I've and I've got to take one, another big step back. So it's a lot harder. The game finishes once you've got three throws into the bucket. So one, two, three, four, five. And I'm going to try and throw it in. Oh, I missed, so I've got to go again. That's the game, so have a go at that one before we get into, into some static stretches. Okay boys and girls, so we're going to go into our static stretches now. Now if we do static stretches at the end of a workout, and you've done some of these before, but we haven't really talked about them yet in the video. And the reason we do these is to help prevent injuries, okay, and help increase our flexibility. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to run through a lot of these static stretches, and they're all going to be, you're going to try and hold each one for 30 seconds, okay. You might see me zoomed up and me, me going faster in the video. So you go them at your own, go do them at your own pace, okay? But try and hold each one for 30 seconds. And I'm gonna show you them all now and I've got to talk through them a little bit as well. So first one is we're gonna do a quad stretch. Okay, that's these muscles here. So easiest way of doing this, we're gonna pick our back leg up and we're gonna pull it into our bum. Okay, so bring our heel to our bum. We're going to try and hold this for 30 seconds. If you're not feeling much of a stretch, you can push back with your foot, but try and keep your hips forward, okay, and push back with your foot, you should feel a bit more of a stretch down your legs. So you're going to hold this for 30 seconds. of your legs okay so best way or one of the good ways of doing this one is you keep your feet shoulder width apart you're going to stretch up and then you're going to lean forward pushing your bum back and then what you're going to do is try and reach for your toes but try and keep your legs straight some some might find this really easy some of you might find this really hard but you're going to try and lean forward and stretch down and try and go as low as you can you're going to try and do this for 30 seconds. Okay, the next one you're going to do is for your calves. That's this bit at the bottom, at the top of your ankle. And the easiest way we're going to do this one is you're going to have one leg at the slight bend and your back leg it's going to stay straight and your heels trying to stay on the floor. And then you're going to lean forward with your front leg. And it's going to want to bring your back heel up and you should feel the stretch in your calves here. So you're going to lean forward, but try and keep your back leg straight, but lean away from it. And 
and you'll feel a stretch down the back of your legs. So hold this one for 30 seconds on each leg. to hurt your muscles it's not meant to make, really make you tired it's more of um, an enjoyment and hopefully you feel a little bit looser and a little bit more flexible at, at the end of that so I really hope you enjoyed this final video uh, if you did give it a like um, and hopefully well I'll see you pretty soon hopefully the school starts back in September <laughs>